the year 303 AD. It is the time of Emperor Diocletian's brutal persecution of Christians. Bishop Januarius of Benevento secretly visits imprisoned believers to console and strengthen them. However, Januarius is soon discovered and brought to the Roman governor, who demands that he renounce his faith in Jesus Christ. Januarius refuses. Pious legends recount that Januarius is soon cast into a burning furnace, but the flames do not even touch him. He is then thrown before hungry lions, tigers, and bears, but they peacefully recline at his feet. In 304 AD, the governor orders the beheading of the bishop and his companions. Eusebia, a Christian woman, gathers some of Januarius' blood into two vials, which are soon buried with his body in the cathedral in Naples. Saint Januarius' legacy lives on. Three times a year, when this martyr's blood is placed close to his head on the high altar, it liquefies and turns red, just like live blood. The blood then solidifies again, the miracle of St. Januarius was first witnessed in 1389 and, remarkably and inexplicably, continues to this day.